Hey yo, what's up everybody? It's B Milton. Welcome back to the channel and you guys today We're gonna be talking about some new Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Now I haven't played Call of Duty since uh, Modern Warfare Remastered which you're watching some of my uh, Highlights uh, montage I put together It's called fight. Uh, it's on my YouTube channel if you haven't seen it and you want to watch it You know non distracted by me talking over it. I just don't have any other really good Call of Duty content recently that I've gotten except for this so that's what we're watching uh, but we're here to talk about the new Black Ops 4 uh, reveal today and most importantly the Battle Royale mode that they're adding in. Now we've heard for a while that uh, rumors saying that Black Ops 4 isn't going to have a single player which I personally don't play the single player so I didn't care about that but I did care about the product value what you're getting for $60. N normally they put in a lot of effort into uh, the campaigns and people that I know play them they said they're good so uh, whoever likes the game for the campaigns they're gonna be shit out of luck but they're adding in a new battle royale mode and my problem with this is that I don't think it's new um, the people who made this game that you're watching right here uh, Modern Warfare Remastered is Raven Software and they made Call of Duty Online which is Call of Duty Online is the only form of Call of Duty that China has and uh, it's also co-created by Tencent, which is like the biggest gaming uh, company in China. And they've had Call of Duty Online, which is basically a bunch of Call of Duties max, like uh, mix and mash together. And that's how we knew that Modern Warfare Remastered was going to have uh, like broadswords in it and all the extra random stuff that they added into Modern Warfare Remastered with the supply drops and everything all the random uh weapons melee weapons and everything we knew what they were and we knew that uh raven software and uh call of duty online already added in all those melee weapons and you know pay to win stuff whatever they've added in all that stuff and now we know that black ops 4 is going to have a battle royale mode which i'm bringing this up because call of duty online in china already has a battle royale mode and I've watched gameplay of it, and uh, the thing is, in the Black Ops 4 reveal trailer today, the guy said that they made the biggest map uh, in Call of Duty, and they put a lot of uh, existing Call of Duty maps from over the years and put them all into one like single map. They mashed them together, and they're, that's the map that uh, Battle Royale is going to be on. Well, guess what? Call of Duty uh, Online in China, they already have basically what they're talking about they have a big map with that has parts of older call of duties in it and uh so basically what i'm trying to get to here is that this is a copy and paste thing that they're doing raven software are the ones who are going to be doing the battle royale mode for black ops 4 it seems and they've already done it they've already made battle royale and it's not that good um the video that i saw only had 18 players in it so I'm not sure if that's the max players that they can have in Battle Royale, but it, I don't know, man. I just don't know. When did Call of Duty lose its way, man? I grew up playing good Call of Duties. Call of Duty 4 is probably the best one. That's why I played Call of Duty 4 Remastered so much, even though it wasn't very good compared to the original Call of Duty 4. Uh, Modern Warfare 2, everyone was, you saw how hype everyone got for Modern Warfare 2 possibly coming out Remastered. But now, uh... The Black Ops 4 multiplayer looks like Black Ops 3, except for they added a grappling hook in. That's really the only thing I got from watching the trailer, is that there's a grapple hook now. Uh, it looks like Black Ops 3. Everyone on uh, Facebook is saying it looks like Black Ops 3. Uh, no single player, but they're like, hey, we got this Battle Royale mode, which, by the way, they've already had the Battle Royale mode. Raven Software's already made it. It's already in a Call of Duty, on, Call of Duty online in China. Um, and... Just watching the the video of what they have so far, uh, it's just not very impressive because, like, you don't you know how in most battle royale modes you get to fly in and choose where you want to land and you know kind of just uh, choose where you want to go from the beginning. Uh, in Call of Duty Online, they do it different. You, uh, I, I actually was pleased to see that you do get to choose where you want to spawn in. But you literally just, you're looking over top of the map and you just select where you want to spawn in with your cursor. And then you spawn there. Now, I don't know how that's going to work. Like, I guess that is better than it just spawning you and putting you wherever it wants to put you. But what if everyone spawns in the same exact spot? 
Um, I don't know. I just think the whole, you know, Battle Royale have... The other Battle Royale games, they have you fly in and land where, you know, other people can see you. And you can see other people spawning in right next to other people. It's probably... Who knows how that's going to work out. But uh, I don't know, man. When did Call of Duty lose its way, man? Call of Duty used to be a franchise that led the way in things, you know? Now... <laughs> they're late to the Battle Royale party. They're like four years late to Battle Royale. They're like years late. And then they're like, oh, look, we can cash in on this um, and just take people's money uh, because everyone loves Battle Royale now after it's been out for four years and it's getting a little bit stale. Now Call of Duty wants to do it. Um, and they're like, hey, you know, we can we can bank in on this and get some money out of it. But the thing is, that's not the Call of Duty I grew up knowing, man. The Call of Duty I knew uh, growing up, they were the ones who would create new game modes. They're the guys who made Nazi zombies. They're the guys who created new things. They didn't follow trends. They did their own thing. Okay, Advanced Warfare had advanced movement. I, I was cool with that. Like, everyone says Call of Duty needs to do something different. I'm cool with them doing something different. But they did Advanced Warfare. They did the advanced movement for one game. That's good enough for me, man. You don't need to have advanced movement in every single game now. And then... In Black Ops 4, they show you the grappling hook, so they're like, yeah, it's boots on the ground, but guess what? Everyone's going to be using this grappling hook to fly around still. Uh, you know what I'm saying? So it's just like, now they're stuck on this advanced movement, which they stole from other games, basically. That's not what Call of Duty was known for. Now they're going to the Battle Royale thing that they're stealing from other people, which, I mean, other games have, other Battle Royale games have stolen Battle Royale from other people. It doesn't matter. That's not what I care about. What I care about is... Call of Duty is losing its roots. It's leaving where it used to be. It's, it, they are on the downtrend, and I just don't understand it, man. Like, you saw how hyped people were for Modern Warfare 2 Remastered. Give us Modern Warfare 2 Remastered and don't fuck it up and don't add in uh, supply drop, web, new weapons, overpowered shit. Don't do that, and guess what? People will love it. You saw how hyped people were. More People were more hyped for Modern Warfare 2 Remastered than they were for Black Ops 4, in all honesty. And then now you see why people were, because... Call of Duty is just don't know what they're doing, man. I don't understand what's going on. It just seems like another cash grab. It seems like Call of Duty is like, what can we do to just make money? Oh, we're going to sell Call of Duty 4 Remastered, but you have to buy, you have to pay $80 for it because you have to get it with uh, Infinite Warfare or whatever. Like, they're just all about the money now. It's just ridiculous, dude, and I don't know what else to say. Um... Video is about to end here. Let me know what you think. Uh, well, I'm, I'm waiting to see if the if the battle royale is good. If the battle royale is good, you know, I'll eat my words, and uh, you know, we have nothing to be worried about. But I just have a feeling it's going to be a low end. Uh, nothing, nothing spectacular. They're just trying to sell more games because they got a new battle royale mode. They just aren't giving you what they used to for sixty dollars. We're getting less for the same amount of money. So I'm worried about Call of Duty. I'm B Militant. Thanks for checking out the video. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.